happy Sunday. So, Amber and I just got back from Target and I thought I would do a quick little haul. I've literally not eaten anything all day and it's almost 12 o'clock. I'm starving. So, I am snacking really quickly, but I just wanted to kind of show. We literally just stacked up, stocked up on snacks. I did put some of it away already, so I'll just show you. Um, actually, I only put one thing away. This is our pantry, by the way. These are our plates. We use paper plates, not all the time, but we do use them sometimes. So, I got two of the Christmas ones because everything Christmas is coming out. I already put this away, too. Our dishwasher stuff, as you can tell. Running the dishwasher. And then this is literally... A lot of what we got. Um, I got some stuff in the bathroom I'll show to you as well. I'll show to you as well. Andrew loves these. I'm in the process of really, really trying to stick to like a gluten-free type of a deal. I don't know that these are gluten-free, but I really wanted to try these. I love the regular veggie straws, and I love spicy stuff, so I wanted to try those. Got some Doritos for Andrew. These um, are gluten-free. I was intrigued partially because I've seen these before, but also because there was only two packages left. And sometimes when I see things that are like super, super sold out, I'm like, okay, maybe I should get those. So I also got, we get a lot of stuff that's the Good and Gather brand, just like the Target one. Um, I've had the white corn, but I wanted to try the yellow corn, again, gluten-free. These I've literally never seen before, but I love types of chips that are like this. So these are their veggie flavored corn ones. So excited. Carrot, tomato, beet, and spinach. Excited for those. We do like sun chips, which I know these are not but gluten free, but I will just maybe have a couple of those. We got two of those. There's another package here. Typically I get the gluten free of the bird spenders, but I saw that they had this paleo one they were out of the gluten-free one but this is just like the chocolate chip so sometimes i'll make this on like sunday mornings we'll have just like a special little breakfast and then i also wanted to try their pumpkin spice one these are literally andrew's candy this is his favorite thing ever cambridge is like having a moment my gum i love bubble gum really i love any gum but right now i'm on a bubble gum kick golden grams for andrew What's the matter? What, baby? You don't need to go lay on the couch. He says, are you sure? They're getting so big, and they are so tired from Halloween last night. It's crazy. Anyway, back to my home. So we got, Andrew wanted to try these just because I make this dip every few weeks, and he wanted to try these Tostinos. I don't know if these are corn. That's a little these are the one thing that I'm not compromising on being gluten free. I literally almost don't want to show these because they are a game changer life made and they're almost always sold out. So there was two of them. So we got both. They're literally just the Thomas Blueberry English Muffins. I am obsessed with these. Andrew's really picky, but I actually even got him to try these. That's what's so mind blowing. I have got my oatmeal. And then we wanted to try this. This is what I'm like snacking on right now. Hopefully if it focuses. So this is just the Good and Gather, again, brand. The Salsa Con Queso. So good so far. I got like a bunch of underwear because I needed some underwear. These are Andrews. He's obsessed with these. Every Christmas time he probably goes through maybe 30 boxes of this. So when he saw these, I kid you not, he started like freaking out in the aisle at Target. It was... I was almost embarrassed, but then again, I'm not. And then, I'll show you the stuff we got in the bathroom. We literally just got the boring up and up soap, so I won't show that. And then we got a package of their paper towels, because life, but also because we have puppies. And then, I also wanted to try out two new things. So, it's an ovulation test, sorry. Um, 
This is the deodorant that I always get, the native brand, but I wanted to try this new type. It's called Vanilla and Chai. It smells amazing. They also had a sugar cookie one that I wanted to try, but I figured I would just go through like one at a time. Usually I try to keep like two of these on hand just because it's my favorite deodorant ever and it's free of all the parabens and all of the aluminum. So this is literally the only thing I use ever. And then I'm in the process of finding a new makeup wipe. So I wanted to try this one. It's called Makeup Melt Bliss Oil-Free Makeup Remover Wipes. If anybody has any suggestions for, if you have any suggestions for, sorry about the light, um, like a chemical-free, not really harsh on your eyes makeup remover, please leave it in the comments down below or DM me on Instagram just because I want to try it. I'm not wanting to put chemicals into my body. I'll also have to show this. Yep. It's love. You guys, like, why is this my life? I can not pour oats into a container, into a bag, into anything without actually spilling it everywhere. And it's the most frustrating thing, and I don't understand why I am but they're like the super cutest containers like am i wrong so we gave the dogs one of their new toys today because andrew's family gave us like this great big bag of toys to give them this is like a ginormous um penguin like it's like perfect if you have two dogs because there's speakers all over the place and it's massively huge and clearly they hate it big scary get it get it <laughs> okay, go. <laughs> Clearly, they absolutely can't stand it. <laughs> Hello. Did you find it? Got the goods. Whoa! We have a one-year-old's birthday next weekend, Whoa. and we need to get her some toys. And I saw this a couple weeks ago at Target, and I was like, oh, I'll just wait to get it till just before her birthday. It was sold out. So Andrew went on a hunt. We gotta get her a little bit more, though. So that's the task for this week. Do you not chew on the Yeezys. Rule number one. Andrew, that was me. Are you okay? Camera just like, yo, bro, need my help? I eat you. The fact that you are big enough. Uh, ouch. 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 Can be mean. <laughs> when all of your silverware is in the dishwasher. <laughs> Who eats tortellini on bread? It's supposed to be toast, but you didn't make it. <laughs> oh. Whoa. Oh. It's always a fight to the death. Hey, are we fighting over a taco? Because if we are, I totally understand. <laughs> Over here, look at this big belly. Look at this big belly. Get him, game boy. Get him. Get him, Bean. Get him. Get him, Bean. Nip him. Nip him, Bean. night dinner for my birthday with my family we're gonna go well we're going to a sushi place Andrew's not getting sushi because he doesn't like it but it's like sushi and Thai um, so he'll probably just get something else obviously the thing about this place for me is I've been coming here I've been coming here since I was in high school so um, I love it. I love um, the food here. I've always really, really liked it. This is actually like one of the first places that I've ever been to get sushi was at this place. 
so it's really exciting. I'm probably not going to vlog anything in there just because we're gonna be with like my whole family and it's just gonna be like a chill time. So we'll see you. Okay, so I am just gonna go ahead and end out the vlog here. Clearly it's the next day. It is Monday morning. I'm getting ready to leave for work and I'm actually getting ready to start another video and I will have that one up after this one. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you have, please subscribe to my channel and feel free to follow me on all my social medias. I'll have them linked down below and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Isn't this how it